Today I want to share with you guys the new and improved Fawny Pack from Fawn Design. So I reviewed the Fawny Pack a long time ago now and it looks completely different. So I'm excited to share this new version with you because I think this one is way better. Um, it's also in a different fabric. Before it was in their pebbled material. This material is actually my favorite from Fawn Design. It's their um, matte material. And this color is called Oat, but they do have this Fawny Pack in a lot of different colors that you can choose from. They also carry it in a leopard print, which is really fun. And then the hardware on this bag is all a really nice kind of matte brush gold hardware. And you can see the Fawn logo kind of stamped into the leather there. This is a vegan leather. It feels really nice and soft and squishy and smooth. So I do enjoy this matte material. And I think this Fawn Fawny Pack is a really good size. It's bigger than their older version, but not too big where it's like overwhelming. I have it packed right now with some of my essentials. I'll show you in just a second. It does come with a couple of different strap options depending on how you want to wear it. There's a longer strap here. They're both um, seatbelt straps and the longer strap is great if you want to wear it um, either kind of as a crossbody bag or even just as a sling bag. And then the shorter version here I think is great for um, if you want to wear the bag fanny pack style. Just to make sure it fits everyone, I love that they have included two different size straps for you. And then I decided to pick up an extra. This is something extra they have on their website. Fun, colorful messenger strap. This one does have the oat material um, on the end, so it matches perfectly with the oat fanny pack. They've done a few videos now on their Instagram showing this particular strap. Um, with a bunch of their other colors and it matches great with all of them and the hardware is all going to be the same for the Fawny packs so the messenger straps and the bags are all going to have the same hardware and that helps to make them look really nice and coordinated together but I absolutely love a good stripe strap looks really good with some of my other like darker brown and camel bags as well this is the width of the strap the bag comes with and then this is the one that I picked up extra and I just love having the comfort of the thick strap. So I'll show you at the end what this looks like on the body with these different straps. Um, for now, let's jump into the bag and I'll show you how I have it all packed up. So you have the two D-rings here on the sides where you can attach um, the straps to. And then you have a front zippered pocket right here. Um, from the side you can tell this pocket is bumped out from the bag, which I like because it has its own um, specific space. So in here I am keeping a package of gum and then I also have a chapstick down there at the bottom. The zippers are super nice and smooth, so I love that. I can do everything with one hand. And you can see this opening is kind of a U-shaped opening and when you open this up the inside is a nice light colored kind of nylon material so it's easy to wipe down keep clean um, you'll notice my phone is probably the biggest piece in here so I'll just take that out and then next to that I have my hand sanitizer spray I have some earbuds in there and then tucked off in this corner I'm keeping uh, my keys now we can see some of the internal structure a little bit better there is a zippered pocket here on the back and this actually fits my um, portable phone charger in there. So if you wanted to use this as a park bag for like Disney or other theme parks and you need to carry a portable charger, this bag carries it beautifully in that back pocket. Let me flip this around so you can see this side better, but there are six different card slots. Um, I noticed that this side, the card slots are looser than this side. They were kind of tight to get in. I'm not sure if that's just my bag or if that is the case with all of the Fawny packs, but either way, I was able to fit three cards over here and I could fit six cards over here on this side just because it's a little bit um, looser than um, these pockets over here. I love that they have added so many card slots in here though because most of the time I have to throw in um, my own wallet that does take up a little bit of space. So I love that this bag includes so many card slots for you to work with. And then the last thing that they've added is this really awesome magnetic pocket here on the back. And I think this is awesome for your cell phone. In fact, let me show you. Here is my cell phone. That's what it looks like. It fits just fine in there, um, but for now I'm just keeping a package of wet ones back there. Again, nice roomy space and the magnet is actually pretty strong, which is great. You can see it kind of finds its home very easily there. 
I've had a lot of requests to review this bag in particular, so I hope that was helpful and gave you a better idea um, what this bag would fit and all of the different pockets. Um, the information for how to find this bag, purchase this bag will be down in the description box. Thank you guys so much for joining me for this review. I hope you're getting a great start to your summer and I will see you tomorrow for my next review.